Hi, uh, welcome to Puppy Training. Three simple insider tips here in this video. If you're dreaming of having a well-trained puppy, maybe you're wishing you could find out those special, uh, those secret tips that uh, help you train your puppy easily to become a well-behaved dog. Uh, even if you've tried puppy training already, maybe you haven't got the results uh, you'd like yet, uh, don't worry, uh, these tips really will help you. Uh, you can train your puppy, it certainly is possible uh, to, to train your puppy quite easily given the information here. There's some other free videos uh, I'll tell you about uh, at the end as well. So, uh, three tips here in this video, very simple, very easy to use, they can really help you out, so let's make a start. Tip number one. How many times have we all heard, oh my dog just won't listen to me at all, uh, he won't behave, oh, such a badly behaved dog, he doesn't do what I tell him. You need to understand, uh, dogs don't understand English unless you actually teach them. They can learn it, but uh, they won't understand it naturally. Uh, we all love our puppies. Uh, we love the way that they focus on us and give us so much attention. We, we become so important to them in their lives. And at the beginning of this, obviously, they, they study us very carefully. They, they'll learn our body language because they focus on us so much. They'll learn about what our facial expressions mean. And tone of voice is very important, of course. But the puppy won't understand your actual words unless you teach it the right way. So if you say, want to go out one day, uh, have to go to potty next uh, the next day and have to pee on the third day, if they do understand anything, it's going to be the fact that you've moved to the door with a certain body language. So if you want to speed up training your puppy to understand English, this can make it about three times as quick. Uh, teach him your language, English. How you do this is you pick one command for each behaviour and you stick consistently with that one word. Uh, tell everyone in your family, make sure everyone's using the same words for each command. Uh, then the puppy will learn very quickly, as long as you're consistent. Tip number two. Uh, you need to understand that uh, your puppy's metabolism is racing along much faster than you might realise. And of course, the younger the puppy is, the faster he's growing, and the more food and water he needs to fuel that metabolism. And so, of course, the more often he has to go to the potty. So, uh, don't punish your puppy if he makes a housebreaking mistake. Uh, all those mistakes are your fault. Your puppy's age uh, and breed and size, size is will determine how often he needs to go out. Uh, once an hour is not too often for a large six-week-old puppy, especially in the summertime. Uh, anyway, dogs love the exciting smells outside, so there's no, no excuse to not having, have him housebroken by about seven or eight weeks of age. Uh, right after his nap, after he eats, and right after grooming are all especially key times. Then he will signal you. He'll actually tell you when he needs to go out. If he's happily chewing on a toy, then suddenly uh, gets up and uh, puts his nose to the floor, starts sniffing around, you've got to move quickly. Every time he goes to potty outside, praise him so much, give him such a lot of praise. What a good boy, good dog, and everything like that. Really go overboard with the praise. Dogs love our praise and uh, the happy expression on our face, a positive tone of voice, uh, and they will do anything to get this. They will really learn what it takes for them to get this positive feedback. Tip number three. Dogs absolutely live for our facial expressions, our positive uh, feedback you give them and positive body language. Because of this, the worst punishment you ever need to give uh, your puppy is scowl and turn away from them for a while. Uh, you can see the results of that uh, very obviously. You'll see his tail fall down and the face will get so sad. Uh, he'll learn the lesson from that. So uh, because his attention spans only a few minutes at this age, don't scorn him any longer than that. Uh, give him some positive, give him a happy face again after that. 
physical punishment is just not necessarily at all with puppies. If you uh, know how to train them properly, using consistent commands, giving good loving praise, positive feedback, he will know what you want really easily. He will really learn your body language and your facial expressions and tone of voice in no time at all. So these uh, three important tips we've given you here, if you use them consistently and confidently, that will start your puppy on the way to being a well-trained dog. If you want more free dog information, click the link below this video. We'll uh, take your name and uh, email address. So because there's, there'll be more videos coming out from time to time, so we'll want to let you know about these as they come out. Uh, but right now we've already got uh, a great video series for you to watch uh, right now. Uh, this includes one really, really simple 10 second tip, which anyone can do. And this, just this one tip can double your puppy's trainability, how easy it is for you to train. There's also the first two videos of those which explain the basic fundamentals of all dog training, how it works, the real principles behind it. Uh, the link's just below the video. Click that link right now. Get all those free videos on dog training.